Okay, so today we're going to be talking about short multiplication. Now, it is really good for you to learn your times tables. So at the bottom of the page here, you should be able to download some questions and answers on short multiplication tables. But for the purposes of today, we're going to be talking about 14 multiplied by 7. And again, I'm going to show you two different methods which you can do that. The first one is where we write it like this. And this relies a little bit on you knowing your times tables. So once again, I want you to really practice those if you can. And the first thing that we do is that we recognise that these are units and these are tens. Cover it again. And I'm going to say, what's 4 times 7? 4 times 7 is 28. So we write down the 8 units. And then we carry the 2 over. And there it is. I'm just going to write it down so I don't forget it. And then the next thing we do is we multiply the 10s. So 7 times 1 is 7, plus the 2 that we had before, which is 9. And we write down 9 in the 10s column. So the answer to that question is 98. There is another method we can do which doesn't rely on you knowing your times tables quite as much, but still you need to practice them. Which is what we do is we recognise that this is tens and these are units. And I'm going to write it out again slightly differently as 14 times 7 can be rewritten as 10 times 7 and 4 times 7. So 10 times 7 equals 70. 4 times 7 equals 28. Add the two together, and the answer is 98. So those are two methods of which you can use. Either this one, where you've got a little bit of carry, or this one, where you break it down. And both will give you the same answer.